Oh, there you go. Hi everyone. Uh, I am back, as I promised. I'm on my way to school. I am running late. Um, yeah, that's all I got going for me. I haven't been to school since Monday because I didn't go yesterday. <laughs> oh shit. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Oh my god. This is a mess. This is a huge mess. So I just got to school. I had to turn off the camera because it was sliding everywhere. And I think I have... 10 minutes to get to class. Which is doable. But I'm probably gonna walk a bit slower because I don't want to go to this class. Alright. I will see you guys when I come back to my car. I'm back. So... Today, the original plan was to wake up an hour early, <clears throat> go to FedEx and ship something out, then go to my morning class, and then go to my job for a little bit, and then <laughs> go back to school for my other class. That didn't work out. <clears throat> Because I decided to sleep in. And if you're one of the people that knows me, you know that if I have to choose between sleeping in or something else, I will, for the most part, choose sleeping in. Unless it's something really, really important. <laughs> um... So now I have to go to my job, then to FedEx, and then back to school. So that just complicated things a little bit. Um, Alright, I will see you when I get to my job. I can't take you guys in because I need to ask permission, but if you guys are wondering what I do, I am a professional dog walker or dog sitter. It is honestly one of the best jobs ever and I'll explain how I got into it later. As I was editing my video for this week I noticed that it was too long so I decided to just divide it in half if that makes sense so this will be like part one and like next week will be like part two so yeah I just wanted to give you guys the heads up yeah I have about an hour till my next class before my spring break started I purchased some stuff off Colourpop and Colourpop is honestly one of my favorite makeup brands I initially wanted to like treat myself <laughs> Because I was like, oh my god, you're halfway done with your last semester. You deserve this. You got this. So I did it. I have two kinds of shoppers. One is the responsible. I need to find the best discount in order to get this or I'm not going to get this at all. And the second is like kind of irresponsible. Kind of like, girl, treat yourself. And then wait for that email from your bank. Um, to check your statements and then when you log on to check your statements you pretend that you didn't see it and you keep on treating yourself. Lately I've been treating myself. Um, I put it back here so I can open it in front of you guys. Um, it came in last week and I was like oh my god I can do a cute unboxing video and so that's what I'm gonna do. If I can open this with my keys, <laughs> you can watch me struggle. Oh wow, that wasn't that hard. I don't usually open things with keys, and I might get in trouble if my parents watch this video. Like, what the hell are you doing? I'd be like, open and box my makeup. What you think? 
and then get in trouble for that. <laughs> Ooh, it's so cute! So this is how it looks when I open it. so cute. I've actually never gotten a ColourPop package in a box. I'm usually getting like the little package envelope thingy. So this is exciting. Whoa. So my camera stopped recording for me because it was like, girl, you have a boring. <laughs> How do I show you this? I got y'all. I'm hoping this is good. I love when makeup brands send you thank you cards because it just makes you feel so appreciated. So cute. This is the back. Um, please excuse my ugly ass nails. Oh my god! Okay. So... I'll show you the palette first. I got their new spring palette called Sweet Talk. Looks like this. Oh my god. This is gorgeous. These are the colors. I got an ultra matte lip. Can't see. Forgot what color I got. It's called Wild Nothing. I've been wanting this one actually. And it looks like this. I also got an ultra blotted lip. I have never tried this from Colourpop. So I'm excited. And the color I got is Vitamin C. So I'm a, a Vitamin C if I like it. <laughs> that was not funny. Oh my god. And I got a Super Shock Shadow called Goodbye Butterfly. This is the cute packaging. I ended up not liking the footage of me trying on the makeup in the car. So when I get home today, I'll just redo all that for you guys. I'm going to start off with the Ultra Matte Lip called Wild Nothing. And I'm going to drop the camera. And then the next time you'll see me is with it on. Just so I don't get any memory card problems. I really love it. It's dark, so it doesn't really fit my, well, in my opinion, it doesn't really look that good on my face right now because I don't have a full face of makeup on. So I'm going to have to try it with full face of makeup on. But like, not now because I'm too lazy for that. Um, okay. So next I'm just going to try the ultra blotted lip. I've actually never tried um, their ultra blotted lip before so this should be exciting. So this is how the ultra blotted lip looks like. I got the shade vitamin C. It's supposed to look more natural and kind of like you have like a lip tint going on. Um, this camera isn't really focusing but I didn't put that much on I kind of just like blotted it on like that and I mean I like it next is the eyeshadows I'm gonna attempt to make this look cute as fuck but my arms are hairy because I am a very lazy person on a scale from lazy extremely lazy and then like Lazy. I'm between extremely lazy and lazy, and I need to work on that. But you know what? Ain't no shame in the game. When I attempted to do this in my car, I was telling a story, which I'll probably add that part in my bloopers because I wasn't going to use that footage anymore. So I'll tell you a new story. I went to Starbucks today and I was about to tell you guys a story. That footage got cut off. I'll show that video before I continue my story. I will go to Starbucks, go to order whenever you're ready. Are we going to do a venti ice, um, white mocha, <laughs> the eight pumps white mocha, 
Is it light eye snowing? Yeah. <laughs> Already. It's been so long. I um, know. And then did you want to do your donut today too? Yeah. Alrighty. Is that all for today? Yeah. I'll see you at the window. Thank you. All right. <laughs> You guys, I need to spill some tea on this barista. Let me get my drink first. As you guys know, I go to CSU. And the Starbucks on campus just doesn't taste as good. Or like, it's just the way they make it, I think. And it's also university prices, so it's expensive. <laughs> so I just go to the Starbucks off campus, and it's also... Um, on the way home, so it's like convenient. There's this one barista, his name is Mark. Well, I'm assuming his name is Mark because his apron says Mark. <laughs> he usually recognizes me through the drive through ordering box thing and he finishes my order for me and it's just like the, the cutest thing ever because he is the cutest thing ever. And I haven't been in a few weeks, so when I went today, he was just asking what's going on, I haven't seen you in a while, and I just felt so special because he is cute. Like, I can't reiterate that enough. I hope that's the right word. So, he's done that a few times. And it always puts like the hugest smile on my face. And I think you can see through the camera how big I'm smiling and how excited it gets me. Because it's just, I mean, it's so cute when you're going to Starbucks and someone just like knows your drink before you can order it. I don't know, you see it in the, in the TV shows and the movies and you're just like, oh my god. They know my drink before I order it. So cool. <laughs> So, if you guys haven't noticed, I <laughs> suck at telling stories. It's just, it's just a part of who I am, sucking at telling stories. I'm running out of arm. <laughs> this always happens. I'll make it work. I'll make it work. Yeah, if you have me on Snapchat, <clears throat> which, go follow me on Snapchat, there's been videos of me getting super excited that he's remembered my Starbucks drink and I'll be right back please excuse my messy ass floor I promise to clean it very soon <laughs> um, the first one from the top right here is actually the super shock shadow goodbye butterfly and then the rest is from the sweet talk pressed powder um, from here it's catch me Side by Side, Garden Date, Work It, Prima Drama, Meadow, Early Morning, Dream Maker, I See Why Am I, Melody, West Side, and Feel Free. I think that's just going to be it for this week's video. I think I have a few things going for it, but I mean... With time, I'll get better at this. So, you know, do your thing. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you guys want me to do. And I'll do it. Don't be afraid to comment. I'm going to do a shout-out this week. And my shout-out goes to all my 11 subscribers. You guys are the bomb.com. Alright, until next time. Tell you guys a funny story while I'm doing this. So last year for Christmas, I decided that we should all, between a few of my cousins, that we should do a secret Santa. And so we drew names and on the paper it gives a list of three things that we would like and three things that we do not like.
or would not like. And so my older brother got my name. And one of my things that I said I like is glitter. And what I meant by that was something with like glitter on it, but it has to be like, you know, cute, like obviously. And Christmas time rolls around. Guess what the hell I got? <laughs> I got a freaking jar of glitter. I got a, a jar of glitter. Glitter. Now, I'm not saying I didn't like it. It was glitter, so, like, I love it. <laughs> but, boy, what am I gonna do with a jar of glitter? I already have tons of jars of glitter. I guess more of the story is be more specific when you're listing out things that you would like. Because, you know, once in a while you'll get someone like my brother who will take it too literal and while everyone else is getting bomb ass gifts around you, you get a jar of glitter. <laughs> it's fine. It's the thought that counts. Oh fuck. Okay. Over the speed limit. Shut up, Frederick. Do you guys call it GIF or do you guys call it GIF? I call it GIF because it literally looks like it should be called GIF. But no judgment if you call it GIF. So cute! Also, just bought a tripod for my camera so I can walk around with it and not be so awkward because this camera is heavy as freak um i'm gonna try not to curse that much but it's really hard for me <laughs> <laughs>